Good Sunday morning. I hope you're doing well. I'm KC reporting for KC Collections in Buchanan, Virginia. It is Sunday, September 24th, and we will pop open today from 11 until 3. So if you want to get out and about on this gorgeous day, this gorgeous day to be, first of all, we, we woke this morning, so that automatically makes it a gorgeous day. But if you want to get out and about on this gorgeous day, I do want to let you know we're rolling. We're open today from 11 until 3. You can see if you watched yesterday's live, I mentioned to you that we were flipping the front over to what's really more like winter, but winter Christmas. Believe it or not, in three months, three months from today, we'll be on Christmas Eve, and I know that is just so hard to comprehend. It is for me anyway. We'll continue our 20% off fall decor today, so lots of folks were out and about yesterday. Definitely getting ready and um, for fall maybe brought out some of their goodies and needed some more goodies. So that may be what you need today. If you stayed um, at home yesterday getting things ready for fall and found you needed a few more things, and remember, we've got 20% off of fall. That does exclude our frame prints and our very limited selection of orange luminara. So again, good morning. I did want to give a shot of this table. It is definitely a cute little table. It's one of our most popular smaller tables. It's a color called Smoke and the accent color special walnut and it's definitely going home with a great family so before we take it apart i wanted you to be able to see that thanks to everyone that has been in the stores the last or in the store the last three days again bring your patience if you come we're doing the best we can but we are on a new computer system and it's going to take a few weeks to work the kinks out checkouts are taken depending on how lucky you get, um, probably three to five times longer than normal, and that's just the fact. So do be advised of that if you come in store um, and you're in a hurry. Just, just know that maybe we're not the store right now until we can get the kinks worked out. So thank you so much for understanding that. We have started to switch things over to winter. Centerpiece Queen was in the house yesterday, and we made a lot of progress in that regard. We've got some furniture pieces that you're going to see are empty. We just um, did not have time, as we did have time early in the day, to get the furniture moved. We did not have time to get everything all decorated up, but you know we will. Don't you worry about that. As we move back here again, um, we have filled the house back up. Abilene Star is still here. So what does that mean? Oh, I'm going to show you something really pretty back here with a new pattern that we have displayed on a brand new color bed for us in just a little bit. It's a great day to go up the Shenandoah Valley for sure to Miscellaneous in Fairfield, just 35 minutes north. My mom has an incredible selection of fall left, things that I do not have here, custom things, things that have been made, things that are just so neat, so different, and of course, more, more than just the seasonal decor. But talking about the fall decor, because at Miscellaneous, there is 30% off today, and Miscellaneous is open 11 until 3, just like I'm going to be open here at KC Collections. So lots of real cutie patooties, as I like to call them, left. Um, great things for just sit-me-ups, great things to add to a centerpiece. But the beauty of where we live, of course, is some weeks we get three seasons in one week, right? Yeah, of course we do. But the other thing is we get to see all those vibrant colors of fall, and it's always a nice change to see the different seasons. I don't know about you, but fall and spring are probably my favorite seasons, um, summer, the humidity is not, not something I definitely crave, uh, but on this other side of the coin, you know, what comes after fall is nothing I crave either. So, but hey, every season is a good season on planet Earth. But you can see the centerpieces have been reworked. They, um, if they haven't gotten pulled apart after being reworked, our centerpieces, as far as our wreaths, are getting very limited at this point. People were definitely in um, all about centerpieces yesterday, but we still have some great ones around. Again, if you're looking for some fall-type items and you want something to just pick up and go, then certainly we've got some great examples for you that still remain on our tabletop. We managed to get most of them 
um, back together. They were together, and then, of course, um, we were delighted to have so many folks in the house yesterday. This one would look great with a candle certainly put in it, but lots of really vibrant sunflower colors. And then, of course, this one is just a little bit more muted, but beautiful, beautiful as well. So if all's on your to-do list, then that's great. If you just want to get out and about, um, and have a day that includes kind of browsing KC, then I want you to know we are here today from 11 until 3. Please bring your patients if you come. So just please be advised of that. Bring your patients if you come as you're going through the register, getting customer service help today. We'll do the very best that we can, as always, of course. As you see here, this is flipped to Christmas. I think I showed you that on the prior live. You can also see we've got a great selection of um, porch signs as well as smaller frame prints and flags. And taking it back here, while we didn't get it finished yet, we worked really hard to get a lot of changes made in store. Um, I do have a tremendous amount of furniture coming and then ultimately a really large shipment of frame prints, hopefully over the next few weeks. But you can see we've moved our wreaths out here, kind of makes sense, right along with the Christmas as we're flipping things over. We've got um, our, I'm going to call them one-offs. The color was intended to be Sealy. It came back a little bit different from Sealy, but it's not quite a cherry color. So these three pieces, I'm going to call those one-offs, and I am going to come up with a price if you buy all three pieces just to get them to go since we cannot match the color. So um, if you hear this and you're in store and you want the pricing and I haven't gotten to it, then just let me know and I'll definitely get that worked up for you. We're still a little junky, as I like to call it, or not like to call it, but kind of messed up here in the back of the store. Um, you'll see in a moment where some of this furniture is going to go um, as we make room for our next shipment. So taking it around just a minute with a drum roll, please. Take a look. See what you think about this section back here. So yesterday I talked about how we were going to get it done, and boy, we get it done. So... You can see, hats off to the team, I, we were all dragging at the end of the day, but that's just a, a wonderful day at KC, you know, so much um, customer stimulation and interaction, and oh yeah, we get our steps in. So again, thanks to the team if I haven't already said that. So Sealy is the color of our bedroom set. You can see that we have matched this up with just that warm feeling new quilt for us. This quilt's been around for a long time, and it definitely has staying power. We wanted to match it up over here with certainly the block border valance, but in addition to that, we wanted to put in Barbara Jeffords, some of her prints. We really focused on getting some of the ones that had more of the browns and the colors that definitely reflected the quilt a little bit better. But notice that Barbara Jeffords is not only known for more of the colonial primitive look in her landscapes, but she definitely likes to use the blues as well. So if those are a choice that you kind of like better, right here side by side, you can sort of see the comparison. She has a wide range of artwork. Um, across the top here is really where hers is on this back wall. But this corner gives you a great representation of all the kind of things that she does. And again, hopefully you like this Sealy color bedroom furniture. It's a great change for us. And our bedroom furniture, we've kind of backed off on selling it now, individual pieces. It seems like that's what people need um, more than anything else. So what does that mean? Right now we're in stock on our number one selling bedroom furniture, which is a black Michael's cherry. It's very unusual that we are in stock on that. I know we're in stock on the king beds. We may also be in stock on the queen beds. I just can't keep it all in my head anymore. A desk that gets covered up quite a lot for us. It's from our... Um, Economy Light of Furniture, there you go. This is pre-coffee this morning. Uh, BC, before coffee, there you go. But it is from our Economy Line of Furniture, but I think they did a really great job in coming up with this creation. A door on one side, it's all in black, non-distress with the cherry accent, and then glides on the drawers in their second version of this desk. They also made it a little bit taller um, or at, a little bit... 
in other words, taller so that there was more room once you sat in the chair between the desk and your legs. So wanted to point that one out as well. And we can get that in a multitude of colors. Of course, I didn't order it in the Sealy. I didn't have the foresight to do that quite yet. But nonetheless, there it is representing um, the desk section. Now, as we move back here, I just want you to know, because we have one empty wall or one empty shelf, and all of a sudden there's a, uh, there goes those rumors. Oh, my goodness, what's going on at KC? Well, we're getting ready for our next furniture shipment, and, oh, yeah, we did sell a lot of furniture, that too. But remember what was back here were the Reeves and the Garland, and we were so busy we didn't get to finish up yesterday. So some of the bigger pieces where the candle aisle is going to go, um, we'll go back to fill this wall. Whether it'll happen today, I'm not sure, but the wall will get filled up, no worries, and there's lots of room back here for our next furniture load to be able to pull some of the, what I call the hot mess on the floor back here as we add more tables and islands um, this week and many other things to our sales floor. This shipment of furniture is predominantly stock furniture, so get ready. We'll have a, a live maybe toward the end of the week. So never fear if you don't get one earlier. It may be Friday before, before I have some things to show you. A reminder that our rooster panels have gone bye-bye in our trash bins, so if those are something you want, I think we have a total of two. They did make it through the day yesterday without selling, so keep that in mind. We may not be able to be as attentive to the phones today, so if you don't get us, just be sure to leave a message. We will return them in the order that we do get them, but right now, again, the computer system has taken all we have. Um, as remember, we are on a skeleton crew. We did have extra folks here yesterday, but we are on a skeleton crew each and every day, but particularly today, definitely on a skeleton crew. So keep that in mind. It may not be the day that, that you want to wait around at the register. And I get that, but we are going to be open from 11 until three for those folks that, you know, aren't in a massive hurry and are willing to be flexible and understanding. And everyone's been great, great, great so far. Well, back here, you know me, I can't take, as I call them, and I think of my grandmother lovingly, rags too long. They're not rags. They're just wonderful pieces of linens that are tablecloths or table runners or bath mats or, I mean, even the Merry Christmas runners, beautiful marked out items that we just don't have room for right now. But I did mention to you that we are getting more tables and islands this week. So what does that mean? Today's the last day of the markdown tables from 11 until 3. When I have more room, there's no reason to mark most of this down. And ultimately, I just cannot stand this, this mess um, out here. What, in addition, what's the reason there we're going to take it up, to, um, certainly before we reopen, we need the room for the furniture coming back. So you can see we've gotten a little loose in the furniture department back here. So we got to be able to fill it back up. It may not be our economy line that goes back here this particular week. I do think our main line of furniture is going to fill the truck up. But don't you worry, there are facts to me lists each and every week of things that are ready. So on the road again, here we go, here we go, right? Computers on the road, computers on the road. So again, in store today, we are a little bit messy in spots, so just look over that. But I do think the team, they always knock it out of the park, did a phenomenal job of not only helping to take care of a huge crowd of people that were in the house yesterday, we made great improvements. I hope you think so. I'm, I'm always proud of the team here. Um, made great improvements in store to be able to pull those off on a Saturday and take care of a, a lot of folks that, that came in. So you can see changes made on these displays as well. So what do I have? Good news. It's a brand new day and waking is the very first thing. Of course, we're all thankful for. But if it makes your day, let me know because I belabored this decision. Let me tell you, opening today, uh, you can probably hear my voice and I'm absolutely exhausted. But that doesn't mean that I'm still not in the market of making people happy. So I know Sundays are a day that 
Uh, maybe folks, you know, can't get in on a Saturday and come in on a Sunday might make someone's day. So if it makes your day, please let me know today because I'm going on nothing but adrenaline. We're here from 11 until 3 today, Sunday, the 24th. And remember, we've got 20% off of fall. In addition, miscellaneous, you need to check it out. Take a ride up the valley. It's a great day for a car ride. Any day is a great day for a car ride. And check out 30% off of fall there. So I was mentioning to you the candle aisle. We're going to make a candle aisle down through here. We're going to put in some of our black um, hutches that are just store display hutches. So that wall that's empty, it's going to be getting this furniture. Probably not today. We're going to probably take it a little lower key today. But that's where a lot of this will end up going. Until our paths meet again, be blessed. Enjoy the journey and make my decision worthwhile. Come out and see me today from 11 until 3. And please bring your patience with you. If you still want to get an error replacement, believe it or not, we made it through the day and we still have fall ones left, although they were definitely popular commodities. Enjoy the journey. Be blessed. And until our paths cross again, know that you are definitely appreciated.